Welcome to part I don't know. Eight. Eight. I had to look at myself. <laughs> I just realized I have no clue. Number eight. Welcome to part eight. We could redo this, but why? We'll just throw this it's in the funny right. moments. There we go. Psalms 23, we're breaking this into two parts. We did Psalms 91, two parts. Now we're looking at Psalms 23. It was 23. Psalms 90, 90. What's it? No, 31. Psalms 31. We did Psalms 31, not Psalms 91. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It wasn't 91. That's, we did you had the one right. <laughs> we did something in the book of Psalms, uh, but now we're going to Psalms 23. It was Proverbs 31. Yes, we're both wrong. <laughs> Do we start all over again? <laughs> no, at this you point. You said good night, good evening. At this point, we're just going to keep rolling. Right, we're going to keep rolling. Welcome to Bible study. We'll we'll just do. Don't you wish you had like that that thing that went the clicker? Boom. Yeah. yeah. Which I always feel like I was gonna get my nose chopped on. Oh, I've never been that famous. We did Proverbs 31. Now we're in Psalms 23. Will we be doing Psalms 91? No, we did that at the very beginning of Bible study. You don't need to know more about that. No, just forget that. Go back and look. Stories. Yes. All right, Michelle, if you, you will look our at our little plant fell. Did it? Yes, it's oh, okay. I'm sorry. Everything's falling. It's fine. It's okay. It's, it's good. It's <laughs> not going to, it's okay. It's all good. Her font on this must be font 1000. No, it's not. It's about a four. It is so big. It's a mess. I also have it colorful so that I can see one verse to the I next. I just, I love you. No, you okay. don't. I can remember as a little girl, used to say, the Lord is my shepherd, that's all I want. Aww. Do you remember saying that? I don't remember a lot from my childhood. I'm sorry. It was, I'm, I'm traumatized. <laughs> Thank you, dear. <laughs> we bribed her with some gummy bears, and you're going to get some later, aren't you? Right now. Right now. <laughs> right now. How many do you want? I want probably three. Three? Three. Goodbye. Goodbye. Daddy Daddy's got them. Daddy has your gummy worms. He's just adorable. Well, she is the best. She is. My what first, my, my first one. Yeah. But that one, perfect. You mean me? <laughs> yeah. Yes, that's the way grandmothers feel. It's like, ah, uh, it's been nice. My children, not so much. My grandkids, amazing. Perfect. Proverbs 31. Yes. It's quite an interesting scripture. I don't know if you've ever read it before, but as a woman, as a woman of God, it can be a little intimidating intimidating you find yourself not liking this woman very not much not very much she's the woman that you look at and you go oh i want to really find fault with her <laughs> but there's none to find there is none to find she can cook from scratch yes yeah, i warm really well she is an incredible microwaver uh, that's just something and, then, and there's friends of mine that doesn't even have microwaves and i'm like <laughs> How do you function? I could understand on a side note, not having the microwave, but how do you reheat things? I get a stove top or an oven, but some things like fast food cannot be reheated on a stove top. <laughs> she holds the distaff and grasps the spindle with her fingers. I don't sew. No. I embroider. Yes, you do with the machine. I just push a button and the design comes. Yes. But I cannot sew. I cannot hand sew. I cannot sew, sew like with a machine. I actually failed sewing class, home ec, in, yes, in high school. She's still embittered, but I am. Um, Our faith will flood that fearful situation and turn it around. That's right. From light to dark, actually, from dark to light. <laughs> it's okay. She still thinks we walk by sight. It's we walk okay. by sight and not by faith. That's okay. I'm not a farmer. I know that's hard for you to imagine, but I have been around people that have herds like sheep or cows. They have a rod and a staff and they use Normally those. Normally it's electrified, but yeah. I'm sure it is. <laughs> a little cattle but rod. <laughs> they have those things to help protect their sheep. It is true. And Jesus so doesn't have an electric He cow. didn't have an electric prod. We are bribing little Miss Grace, who's two and a half years old, with some gummy bears to just come and say hi. Do you want to say hi, Gracie? Hi. Oh, you did so good. I did you want your gummy okay, bear? Get down and go. Okay, there's your gummy bears. Say thank you. Thanks, say bye bye. Oh, you got gum. I wish I got gummy bears to do this. Oh, and they're, <laughs> they're in the mouth. <laughs> okay. This is a scripture that I struggle with because I love to shop. But this one always reminds me that if I can't shop, God's going to take care of me. Which remember during the first, you know, slow the curve 15 days, the stores were closed. That's right. I saved a lot of money. Unbelievable the amount of money she saved. But 
if that happens and close, you know, stores shut down, here's your scripture. Here's your scripture. Deuteronomy 29 verse 5, it says, Yet the Lord said, During the 40 years that I led you through the wilderness, your clothes did not wear out, nor did the sandals on your feet See, that's a out. sad, sad verse for me. <laughs> but imagine that for some of us, you know, potentially in the future. My bell bottoms would be in style. They would. And, they they would and, and my 90s hair clips. Those are now back. Really? Do you notice I'm trying to do the center part? If you want to, pumpkin, that's fine with me. And my hair doesn't like it. But you know what? I'm, I'm trying to be cool. It's interesting, though. In the 90s, there was a lot of things that were in fashion. We'll see. And they're I back have to go now. back just a little bit more. Yours would be the 70s. Yeah. Wow. Imagine that. And a fun fact about me, I don't like change. She doesn't. <laughs> like, any type but of change. Nobody does, really. Some people thrive off of it. I don't know. Like, have you ever been in someone's home, and you walk in, and then you come back, like, two weeks later, and all the furniture's been moved, and then you leave, and then you come back, like, a month later, and all the furniture's it's been moved? It's a lot moved. of work. <laughs> Once the couch is in its spot, we do not touch it. Our VCR broke, so that tells you how many years ago that was. About two or three years ago. And uh, we went and bought one, Mike and I did. Another and, VCR. And we brought it home and we installed it and didn't think there would be an issue. Someone started screaming and crying and saying, I'm never going to be able to use this. What happened to my other VCR? And we did the whole thing. It's broken. It needs to be replaced. And it was like, no, no. But I got over it once the microwave broke and we had to buy a new microwave and that was a whole new tier. Theft. That's right. Always yes. such a fun joy to have y'all in our home. Yes. It's always a joy. We have a stone wall. We do. It's, yes. It's all fake. But <laughs> it's a facade. It is a We're facade. We're not a facade. No. Everything around us is. God said, use the example of sunblock. So often now we need the sunblock. We have we have the 50 stuff. What what's interesting is on a random I got burnt this summer. Okay. And it was so red and it went back to my original color of yes. just very stark white. What are the things that you think of when you think of July 4th? Well, for one, I think of fireworks because you hate them. I don't like them. She no. She's worse than a little cat. I don't like she them. She hides in the corner. I don't like them. At all. Okay. I don't know about you. I got this from you, actually. Okay. This is a bad habit. Oh, so okay. Yay. All my bad habits came, came from, from my mom. mom. Yeah. Um, I tend to have a very dove-eyed look, which is good because you're very focused. You get very focused on your beloved. You get very focused on, on tasks and goals. But a lot of times in my mind, if it didn't work out this way, then it's not going to work out. Okay. And so you get very focused. I don't know if you're like this, but I, I am. Really. I blame you for okay. it. okay. Blame me. I like to blame her for this. It's okay. It's all good. And I'm going to condense it into three different points. You know that Southern Baptist that I have in me. Number it's, one. It's deep in there. How old are you? Two and a half. She's two and a half. What's your name? Grace Michelle Haney. Grace Michelle Haney. And how do you spell Grace? G-R-A-C-E Grace. Yellow is, is such a, a good color because it means that you're bright and happy and sweet, which you are. Um, All the time, right? <laughs> <laughs> Unless we're hungry. Then we can be a little, you know, two and a half. But that's okay. I went to go buy some celery the other day. She likes celery juice. I do. It's, it's, her new it's, thing. it's my new thing. I like to drink it in the morning. Yes. She's and, so healthy. Yes, can't you tell? Don't I look 20 years younger and 50 pounds lighter? Here in Hamilton, we're growing like we've never we grown are. before. This is good. It is, and it was something we had prayed that God would it's bless. It's all our fault. <laughs> you know, but we had prayed. And it was just a quaint little town, and now we have subdivisions, we have businesses coming in, and God has truly blessed us, but now I hear people complaining. They are full of so much stress. There's so much traffic on Highway 93. It's all you Californians. Yeah, well, Oregon's, Washington State. Oregonians. All these other people. But they've been fussing. You can't even turn left. I mean, absolutely. Because we don't have traffic lights. Angry. We still have stop signs. We don't. We don't. We have a couple of traffic lights now. Four. <laughs> but the whole thing is, is that people get upset. They Thank choose you. what they're going to worry about. And it's like, couldn't you just say, God, thank you for the prosperity of our city. No. Thank you, Father, that you're going, aren't, <laughs> thank you, God, 
that you're going to increase our ability to witness she to people. To be, no, we're just going to get angry about the traffic. Yes. Psalms 37 and verse 18 through 19. 18 through 19, I knew that. It goes on in verse 13. 13. I'm not listening well today. She's not, am I? but it's okay. It's normal. It's okay. 23 through 29. And I love it. I'm going to try not to interrupt you. I don't, I didn't listen to where I'm turning to. Okay. <laughs> I'm really not listening to anybody. Psalm 78. I thought you said 28. And no. I'm like, I don't have that mark. Psalm okay. 20, 78. I may have said 28. <laughs> verses 23 through 29. I've got to drink my coffee. Okay, while she drinks her coffee, I'm going to read half the Bible here. He gave them bread from heaven. Those are like, you know, mama's rolls. Oh, I know. Those are good. Bread from heaven. With, Go ahead. With slathered in butter. I Glory know, to God. Butter. butter helps. That's the manna. Butter okay. makes everything better. Verse 27, he rained meat down on them like dust. That's the Chick-fil-A. Well, it could be, or it also could be steak. But you don't like steak. I don't, but She but puts still. ketchup on her steak. Excuse me. How many of y'all raise your hand if you put ketchup on your steak? So wrong. No, it's But the meat, the meat coming down, I believe that was Chick-fil-A. 1 Kings chapter 17 and verse... Four. Four. You said nine, didn't you? No, I, I don't think. You may have to rewind, but I don't think I did. I may have. We're not doing good with our numbers no, today. No, we're not. We would not be winning at bingo. That's because I'm hungry. Go ahead. <laughs> well, pray for... I know. God, provide my chicken. Pray for the bread to come down. <laughs> it says, a good person leaves an inheritance for their children's children. No, that would be grace. <laughs> you have to do it for grace. <laughs> come on now. Put me in that wheel. So, we love you all so much. Have a blessed week. Know that we're praying for you and we're believing God's best for your life. There was a bug. There is a bug. I'm going to try to... I was scared I was going to swallow him. I know. He was... And it's not a fly. It's like a gnat. Like a gnat. I know we've got potatoes. Well, I opened up that door to get this. So I don't know if he was in the garage because they didn't shut the garage because they didn't want to make a mat, uh, noise. I don't see him, but I don't either. He, he kind of left. Yeah. You hear that noise in the back? Mine wasn't hearing it. It was like he was right here. I and I found myself getting ready to swallow it away and I thought, no, no. They probably no. can't see it. But who knows? Oh, I need to stop recording. <laughs> Just